Hi everyone. You have been upgraded to the printer logic printing system. And what that means is your printing should print more efficiently, not have all the problems that you possibly had in the past. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install a printer. Say if you're in an office, maybe you need to print down to a printer that is down the hallway from you. Maybe you're on the first floor and you need to print to a printer that's on the second floor. Using the printer logic system, you can install the printers that you need to whenever you want to. I'm going to show you how to do that. In order to do this, normally you would open up your control panel and you would go to devices and printers. I'll readjust this, change it to small icons, and when you're in your control panel, you should be able to click on devices and printers, and that's going to show you the printers that are available for you to print to. So say if the printer you need to print to is not listed here, all you have to do is go to the following web address when you open your Google Chrome web browser. Once you have that open, go to printers.tndagc.org. It should take you to your specific printers page for printer logic. You can see here I have two folders, two areas where I am assigned. Say I want to print to some of the other printers that are available for me. And you can see here I only have two actual network printers that I can print to and say I wanted to print to this printer right here. Now you're going to know or be uh, given notification of what printer that is. This is the printer name column. You'll know that by the D means district. The district number will be your computer. Uh, or printer. Ours is 00, zero followed by the city or the office and then followed by maybe an item description or location description such as TR for training and then the or and or HP say for Hewlett Packard the manufacturer make and then the model of printer. Over here it's going to show you the driver that it's going to use and then also the location should that be provided. All you have to do to install any printer is left click on it. It will ask you, do you want to install this printer? And then give you the selected printer that you want to print to. All you have to do is click yes. Wait for everything to install. You can see here the printer has been successfully installed. And I go back to my control panel you can see over to the right here, it did install the printer that I had just made the selection for. And some of these other options or these other printers and fax machine here, these are specifically assigned to my account. And they are currently all available to be able to print to. If you happen to have any questions, please let us know. We hope this is giving you a a brief discussion or overview of how to manually install printers using the printer logic service. Thank you. Have a great day.